what we're trying to do is challenge the design of cameras and other kinds of imaging devices. If you get right down to it, we've spent the last 400 years perfecting a single design for a camera that consists of a sensor and a lens. We're trying to change that in a radical way. In our approach, we're trying to challenge the three-dimensionality, the chunkiness of standard camera designs by a new approach that can make cameras very, very flat. So they could be very thin, they could be very flexible, and they could be used in a lot of applications where lens-based cameras just can't be used. And the key idea is to replace the lens in a conventional camera, right, which performs the focusing, by two elements. First, a very thin mask that we can lay directly on top of the sensor, and then a computational algorithm that runs on a computer that extracts the, the image from the, the measurements that we acquire with the mask. This is FlatCam. What we have here is another prototype of FlatCam. Uh, it's just set up on this structural assembly for us to do prototyping and experiments. The cable that you see here is the data transfer cable. The images acquired by our sensor are sent to the computer through this data transfer cable. In the computer, inverse algorithms are used to focus and reconstruct the image. This camera does not have a lens. The computer algorithms do the task of focusing and reconstructing an image from the measurements acquired using FlatCam. These are early days, and we're still uh, there's still a lot of work to be done to perfect uh, the, the, the technologies and the techniques. But what our design offers is a completely new design space that we can work with to design exotic new kinds of cameras, e extremely flat cameras that could be used for different kinds of industrial or medical devices. Also cameras that could be flexible or curved to image uh, in ways that are frankly impossible with a, with a lens.